Well, if you like your prosciutto, you're in the right place. And hopefully we're feasting on a fair bit of decent football action here in Parma. Derek Ray here on the commentary box, joined as always by former Arsenal and England fullback Lee Dixon. And the focus is very much on Serie A, the top division here in Italy. It's Parma facing Milan. Thanks, Derek. I'm sure both coaches will want their players to start with a real zip in their play. Really show the opposition what they're in for. That could lead to fireworks. Let's hope so. And a look at the starting lineup for Parma. If you like wingers, you'll love this league. Yeah, absolutely. I love to watch a winger play, especially with pace and power. The central striker will stay more or less in front of the goal. The support will be provided by the three central midfield players. The back four is pretty conventional, but the fullbacks will be asked to support from behind. Grazie per essere qui. This is the Milan starting 11. And this is a formation most people in the game are very familiar with nowadays. Yeah, most coaches are adopting this formation. What it does give you is two holding players in front of the back four to protect them. But it also gives you three supporting players to that central striker. Hernani. Oh, nice ball over the top. Yasmin Kurtic. Well, he's thwarted him almost effortlessly. Rade Krunic. Kessier. Zlatan Ibrahimovic. Well, pressing high is something the visitors like to do. It can take a lot out of any team, but it is very much their game. Lee, would you expect that approach this time? Yeah, absolutely. The press looks on the way the team's set up. High energy is needed for this tactic. Everyone has to buy into it, but the rewards are big, Derek. Yasmin Kurtic. Well, what can they do to stop him running at them? Oh, that's an awful finish, and the goalkeeper could do nothing but hang on to it. Easy save for the keeper. Absolutely terrible finishing from the attacker. Salamakers, and Milan moving the ball with purpose. Sandro Tonali. Ibrahimovic. Can he do it? What an important piece of defending. No let up in the pressing department. Salamakers. Tonali with it. Oh, nice ball over the top to chase. And able to close down the shot. Well, the fans know they were lucky not to be behind there. They can't keep conceding chances like that. That's a foul, and it will be a potentially dangerous free kick.
And nicely struck. And a goal almost bewitching in its beauty. Excellent technique. Well, what a beautiful free kick this is, Derek. He knew exactly what he wanted to do. And just look at the flight of the ball. It's so flat, barely any deviation. Fantastic free kick. The opening goal of the game then. Ha segnato il Milan con il numero 10, Akan Chalanoglu. Sandro Tonali. It's a promising Milan move. Tomori. Tonali with it. Now potential danger. Just couldn't get it through. Andrea Conti. Brugman has it. Yasmin Kurtic. Really getting stuck in defensively. Sandro Tonali. And that puts them in position. Real danger. Tonali with it. Could be. Oh, tremendous goal. Technical excellence to finish that one off. Wonderful to have that in your repertoire. Well, here we can see, Derek, from this better angle, it's all about the technique. When you're volleying a ball, it's all about timing. Let it get to the right place for your foot to make the connection. And there you go, in the back of the net. So 2-0 now. And just one minute of stoppage time, say the officials. Really good challenge. Zlatan Ibrahimovic. And with that, the first half draws to a close. And we're highlighting him for a reason. He's putting in a really authoritative performance here late. Well, his movement is so good. You can see why he causes defenders so much trouble and a goal to boot as well. Back in business here, and Milan very much bossing it in the first half of this match. Will we see more of the same in the second half? Milan certainly enjoying the lion's share of possession here, and all of their team are enjoying this performance. That's why they're winning, and that's why they're one of the best teams. Spraying passes around, almost waiting for the opposition to make a mistake. Chalanolu. Teo Hernandez now. Sandro Tonali. And they need to get tighter. Ibrahimovic. Wonderful chance. Alexis Salamakers. That is a very fine challenge in difficult circumstances. Diogo Dallo. 
Diogo Dallo on the ball. And 30 minutes left for play in this match. Ibrahimovic. Chance to finish. And he'll take efforts like that all day long. Gaston Brugman. Pelé with it. Teo Hernandez. It's with Chalanolu. Chalanolu. Cassier. Oh, good use of the ball. And return to Chalanolu. Tonali with it. Possibilities for Ibrahimovic. Well, what an opportunity, but really good defending, you've got to say. Cassier. And here's Chalanolu. Magnificent challenge to win it back. Can they hit on the break? 15 minutes remaining. There wasn't much in that offside decision. Could have been in business. Sandro Tonali. A real defensive commitment there. And winning it back. Sandro Tonali. And the cross is very much on. Zlatan Ibrahimovic. Ibrahimovic, ideal for the goalkeeper, for any keeper. Hernani. Well, that ball looks promising. Moving forward effectively. Cipria. Can he finish? They've got themselves back into it. A lifeline in this game. And this could be a dramatic finale. Well, here's the replay, and they do say a keeper should never be beaten in his near post. And he's made that error, and he's been punished. Big mistake for me. Well, 2-1 it is here. Ficayo Tomori. Kessier. Not a huge chunk of added time. One minute. Beautifully timed, and there it is, the final whistle. Not what the home fans were hoping for before a ball was kicked today. Defeat for them. Well, there's no doubt that we're disappointed. No points gained today, and that will hurt a little bit. I think the manager knows they weren't quite right today. They need to regroup and go again. And the final analysis, a really positive performance from this man, Lee. Well, he played well, scored a goal. What a good performance from him.